try watching the miracle of thanksgiving without crying it's a pretty impossible task this is a beautiful episode of full house it's the ninth episode of the first season directed by peter baldwin and of course this takes place on thanksgiving day and everybody wakes up everybody's very excited jesse's very tired but it turns out that Unfortunately, uh, Danny's mother is snowed in so she can't make it and she was the one who was going to be making Thanksgiving dinner. And initially, the adults decide the best thing to do is to go to a restaurant. And Stephanie's kind of okay with that, but DJ thinks that it's it's a terrible idea because last year their mother made them uh, a wonderful home-cooked Thanksgiving feast and this is the first year the girls are having Thanksgiving without their mother, which is pretty hard, <laughs> hard to watch because the emotions are right on the surface throughout the entire thing. But then when things start to go wrong with the dinner, it gets all the more upsetting because DJ's devastated, Stephanie's devastated. The adults are keeping a level head, but then obviously the adults, Jesse in particular, start to think about uh, Pamela and, and the memories there. And it just becomes really beautiful and really emotional. And... I just thought it was so beautifully executed, so well done. And even with all that raw emotion, there is humour. For example, we have Paula and Alexandra, who are in this for a couple of minutes. I won't say exactly what their role is, but they they bring an interesting uh, couple of minutes that helps to lighten the mood a little bit because it's quite a bizarre situation. So it's not completely like a d depressing episode. But I mean, I'm, I'm welling up just thinking about it. it. It will, it will move you. It will really affect you. And in a way, it, it's it's so beautiful. And it really helps to, to, to share the message that Thanksgiving isn't really about the food. It's about being thankful for the people you do have and making the most of the time with your loved ones while you can, which is so lovely. And there's a beautiful scene between Danny and DJ and obviously with the recent passing of Bob Saget it was just all the more emotional to watch and we have a great scene between Jesse and Stephanie as well so I really really thoroughly enjoyed this episode but it really is um, very emotional. We also have what I think is the first bit of acting from Michelle because at the beginning she comes into the room on a little toy bike like a little motorbike thing and Jessie tells her to pop a wheelie and we actually see little Mary Kay or Ashley lifting up the front of the bike. I don't know how long it took. I don't know how many takes they had to do. But that, I think that's the first time we've seen Michelle actually doing something, following an instruction, acting something that I assume was in the script. I don't know. It could have been ad-libbed. But certainly that's the first time Michelle's really contributed something like that. And I... I just loved it, being a huge fan of Mary Kane and Ashley, it just, I adored it. Um, definitely a lovely episode, funny when it needs to be, but ultimately very sentimental, very emotional, and an absolute joy to watch 